In a bid to reduce the prevalent rate of cancer in Niger State, Governor Abubakar Sani Bilu has flagged off the human papilloma virus screening and cervical cancer prevention services at the Jumai Babangida Maternal and Neonatal Hospital, Mina. Chenemi Bami reports. World Health Organization estimates that more than nine of every ten cases of cervical cancer are caused by the human papilloma virus, which can be prevented by HPV vaccination. Cervical cancer is the only type of cancer caused by HPV that can be detected early by a recommended screening test, which is why the United States government is flagging off the HPV screening exercise. Governor Sonny Bello said he is aware of the disturbing situation in the state and he is determined to remedy the situation as well as meet the 1970-90 World Health Organization cancer elimination strategy in the state. His administration will also offer continuous support to the state university in the area of research in cancer and other life-threatening diseases. It is verifying that this is the first of its kind. Uh, we started off early and uh, I think what is important is not just being forced, but what is important is for the ordinary women well, it has to be able to access the screening. So uh, we are not in competition. We only want is to see that uh, we achieve what we want to achieve. Wife of the Niger State Governor, Dr. Amina Abubakar Bello, disclosed that cervical cancer is the fourth leading cause of death among women, affecting about 1.4 million women. It is also the most common cancer with women living with HIV and about 80% of the cancer occurs in low- and middle-income countries, including Nigeria. Any woman who is in the reproductive age group is entitled or is eligible to have this uh, test. She's supposed to come to the, any of the designated facilities and a simple test, which is a swab that is usually taken, is taken from her. Now, depending what the result is, if she has HPV, then she is taken further for treatment. And the treatment, uh, they're different, depends on what um, level she is. If it is determined to be a cancerous case, then she will be referred to the appropriate facility. But everything is going to be done for free. She doesn't have to pay anything. The state government and the partners have taken care of all that. I want to assure you here that this is not just a one-off. Uh, we are also building uh, this program into our contributory scheme so that it is also sustainable. So it's not going to be limited to this nine local government alone. Lessons learned will now teach us how to scale up. The pilot screening is targeted at 5,000 women across nine local government areas of Niger State. But the program is set to spread across the 25 local government areas in the coming months. Chenemi Bami, TVC News.